Alex Jones was recently uh, commenting on something that Joan Rivers said about Michelle Obama. And of course, it was something that was a little controversial. I'll let you judge for yourself. Take a look at it. Do you think that the country will see the first, the United States will see the first gay president or the first woman well, we president? We already have it with Obama, so let's just calm down. Got it. You know Michelle uh, is a trans. Uh, I'm sorry, she's a what? A transgender. We all know. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> she said it funny. She said it funny. Did, you know, it's funny. The first time I saw it, I didn't think it was funny. But like the way we just edited it there, we just we cut off the 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 end and the beginning. Oh. And like it's much better. Like yeah. she, it's actually pretty funny. We all know it. She yeah, yeah. Like, we all, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. But it's it's crazy Aunt Joan. She right. can say whatever she wants. She's a comedian. comedian. Yes. Boy, like, I wish she would take off that comedian mask oh, and let us man. know. <laughs> Real joke. All right, so so Joan Rivers does that. It, it was obviously meant to be a joke, right? And I, I could understand why some people would still be offended by it, but still, I think as long as it's a joke and as long as you are a comedian, which is what she does for a living, yes. move on with your life. Well, Alex Jones took it seriously. And uh, here's what he had to say on his own show about Michelle Obama. The question is, who is Michelle Obama? Is she really a woman? Is she a man? Every time I look at Michelle or Michael Obama, uh, the first lady or the first tranny, every time I look at them, something doesn't look right. She doesn't look like any black woman or any woman I've ever known. She's got shoulders that are wider than a man's, which physiologically doesn't happen. Again, you can put three heads on a man's shoulders and only two heads on a woman's shoulders. That's a known anatomy. And then women generally have wider hips than, than men do. And you look at her arms and the rest of it, when she's standing straight on, she looks like no woman I have ever seen. He nailed it. Wow. He nailed it. May yeah. I make a suggestion before we start? No anatomy. How many heads can you put in his stomach? <laughs> Morning radio, syndicated across the country, waking up with Ablo and Jones. Ah. Wouldn't you love to see them together? <laughs> totally. It'd be great. Well, if Joan Rivers insane. married him, she'd be Joan Rivers Jones, which would be nice. That would be nice. Yeah, also we'll amazing. Happening. Thank yeah. you. Or uh, Alex Jones could be Alex Jones Rivers. I don't know if that's funny. You were saying, Anna? <laughs> um, <laughs> I mean, I'm just, I'm gonna throw it out there to you guys. What do you guys think? What are your thoughts? I mean, there are people out there who think this guy is legitimate, right? He'll, yeah. He's a conspiracy theorist. Yeah. That's what he's known for. He's one of those people who will get a few conspiracy theories right, and so people think that he's credible, right? He's, he's a got, legitimate I, I person to get nothing, news from. Right, ever. Yeah, he's, and he's like the National Enquirer. Man, he did some good work on the OJ thing. Right, I'll tell you right. that. That's right. You get the National Enquirer got some stuff right on OJ. No, like, that's like, like, so then now it's, somehow it's okay. Yeah. And also, uh, uh, Edwards, right? Yeah, John Edwards. John yeah, yeah, Edwards. Yeah, yeah, sure, they pay for stories, and sometimes the, they pay people who know the, the story. Yeah. That, that happens. Um, but uh, he's a nut job. He's a dangerous guy, and it's a shame that, that, that some people who you'd think might be reasonable listen to him and sort of buy this nonsense. Known physiology. Known physiology. Known you can physiology. Put, you can, known physiology. You can put three heads on a man. Now he's a doctor, and, too. And two heads on a woman. It's known physiology. Yeah, it's, no. what kind of, who talks like that? What kind, of, what kind of crazy person talks like that? <laughs> and then they show these pictures heads. of Michelle Obama where she looks spoken hot. Yeah, she right, looks you know? like she's And I'm like, oh, my God, what a great-looking yeah, woman. She's toned. Yeah, toned, right. Yeah. How dare she be toned? Yeah. yeah. yeah look. Alex Jones, like, I've been eating, like, 12 hot dogs a day, and I, I don't have shoulders like that, because you're a fucking <laughs> fat ass, and to talk shit about the way Michelle Obama looks is so ridiculous. Look, I, I know and it's you make a great point, yeah. though. Anyone that curvy and doughy, and I think I speak from direct experience, is female. Huh, right? right? Am I right? Yeah. Oh, Thank you. Alex Jones? <laughs> Miss Alexia Jones and I should go get a coffee, because he is every bit as curvy as I am. Well, I, you know what? I, he's a lot more masculine, Alex Jones, since he stopped wearing the push-up bras. But I think... <laughs> By the way, uh, Christopher Darren wrote in on TYT Live. I think Jimmy Dore is my favorite uh, American comedian since BillHicks.com. That's nice. But that was before this segment. Wow. So, oh, yeah, yeah. that still is nice. That is very nice. That yeah. is yes. huge. Um, uh, I mean, he's a... And by the, I, and I think there's some crossover. I suspect there's some TYT fans yeah, there, who, there who, who probably listen yeah. to Alex Jones and believe him. Uh, although Al, no, oh, come on. Then speak to them directly. What would you like to say to them? You just apply uh, logic to what Alex Jones says, right? And because uh, Bill Hicks used to say the way he comes up with his comedy is he applies logic to the situation. Whatever is left over is the funny part. 
So if you apply logic to Alex Jones, there's just all funny parts. Yeah, it's all funny parts. Right. left over. Yeah. Yeah. He's, so I don't think people who like the Young Turks were actually because they're logical. That's why they like Jenk. He cuts through the bullshit. He doesn't make up bullshit. Well, that's what bullshit. Alex Jones does. And by the way. Uh, if that's what a transsexual looks like, then I'm totally into transsexuals. <laughs> yeah, yeah. By the way, uh, transgender is the right way to refer to someone. The word tranny is inappropriate, unacceptable. Did Alex Jones say it, or did just Joan Rivers it's say it? It's a crazy at Joan yeah. term. Oh, yeah. 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 Joan Rivers I will say there is a comedians. little bit of controversy in the transgender community over the word tranny. Right. It's just kind of like how the gays have tried to take queer back. We're here, we're queer, get used to it. Yeah. So a lot of the transgenders are trying to do that same thing. They're trying well, to call themselves trannies. We're and, trying to take a banker back. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's... <laughs> And huh? Huh? <laughs> well, even on this show, I actually when I was when I was filling in one time, and I said transgendered, I actually got in a little bit of trouble for that. I, I, that yes. That's not a, a politically correct term either. Right. FYI, e yeah. I'm yes. a terrible person. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> yes, everyone knows that the suffix ed is very sexist, right? <laughs> I think because, that picked yeah. up on the because, uh, lapel mic. Why is that sexist? Uh, it, 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 obviously, right.